you don't want a cowboy supplier. That's yeah. that's another thing as well, in the sense of like, there's with with Jay, there's a there's a process, there's yeah. a process, yeah. there's 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 stages, there's it's, it's almost sort of processed as you know. I, I like a large firm in that sense, in the sense you know you have initial meeting, you've professional, got, yeah, professionalism professional. is is there, it's a hundred percent there. So we ended up booking Jay because around nine, ten years ago, me and my friends at university used to sit and watch his videos on Vimeo. So at that point, we had decided that when we get married, we were going to book Jay, and that's how it turned out. Um, I got recommended, obviously, through um, other suppliers to actually go with Jay in that sense as well. Um, said he was a friendly, approachable sort of service in that sense as well. Which so. is so true from start to finish. Jay has been so great to work with. Yeah, so, sure. like, we just we met him on the first day, and he talked to us for about five ten minutes. Knew exactly what we wanted. Knew exactly what kind of people we were, and just ran with it. And I'm so glad that we let him run with it because sure. everything's well, so perfect. Yeah, and a lot of, a lot of the experiences we have with with suppliers and what 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 the biggest fear with suppliers as well because uh, you you don't you don't really know them know them right. So a lot of it is you don't want a cowboy supplier. That's yeah. that's another thing as well, in the sense of like, there's with with Jay, there's a there's a process, there's yeah. a process, yeah. there's 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 stages, there's it's, it's almost sort of processed as you know, I, I like a large firm in that sense, in the sense you know you have initial meeting, you've professional, got, yeah, professionalism professional. is is there, it's a hundred percent there, but also the friendliness is there because mm. you can chat to him, you can you can have a laugh with him, and you want that, you don't want weddings are stressful already, you want nice nice just kind people around you for sure yeah agreed and then um i guess on the day was probably the next step right yeah is on the yeah, day yeah, when yeah. we seen him yeah um he was at the venue way probably, before us probably before the sun came out so he was taking all these random shoots putting dresses on trees and putting <laughs> trying to lose our wedding ring and, and all sorts just doing just everywhere doing all these random shoots shoots you would not even think of you know um but when you see the end product, you see the fact that these things come together and you see the fact that it it doesn't boil down to the technology or it doesn't boil down to the camera. It boils down to that talent, that, that talent or that eye for detail or that that knowledge of, OK, if I put this here, it will look different, which to a normal lay person or person, you know, not in, in the industry. It just for me, like I said, a lot of the times when I'm looking at some of the stuff, I'm thinking, why are you doing that sort of thing? But when you see the end product, it, it definitely, definitely all sort of ties in together yeah. and, and, and works. And that's where you see straight away, you know, off the bat, first thing in the morning, you see the fact that there's a different level of professionalism. Yeah. Um, and the only other thing I can I can add is I don't know what these guys eat, but from like six in the morning to like eight p.m., they, they it, it was it like was pure grass. It, it was pure it was grass. like they were on like Lucasade orange for like for like eight hours. Like that's how it, it was. They were just they were running around, you know. They were running. They were not missing a single shot. Anything yeah. was going, and they were running and, and and taking that shot. You know, just the whole team as well, not just Jay himself, but like the whole team was doing the same. Like I remember very very vividly like as soon as i got there came out the car he didn't give me a chance to tie my shoelaces before he took a picture of me tying my shoelaces but uh yeah they're just there straight away you know it's not oh you know where's the photographer well let's go let's go ask the photographer to come here he's already there yeah he's the, the attentiveness and the, the the attentiveness to both the bride and groom was close 100%. to nothing for us to be fair 100 percent and um, the trust was there from day one. Jay said jump, we said how high, and mm, it was so worth it. Mm, so worth it. For sure, for sure. And we had a few, obviously, the the other thing that I thought for me personally was quite different as well is um, a few requirements as well, you know. So, you know, everyone, everyone in their own wedding will have your own requirements in that sense as well. So for me, it was more the fact that, look, I'm not going to, you know, I'm not, not going to sit there, you know, under a tree and do all these lovey-dovey shots or like, you know, something... <laughs> way too extravagant you know that was the yeah, case right yeah, like yeah. i like it i just I, talking about it is cringy sort of thing you know it's one of them ones I, I i i don't like cheesiness you know i don't like cheese it's not me and it's like let's keep that to a minimal but not 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 so much where you know you 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 alleviate away from the fact that it's a wedding and mm. it is a sort of you know it's it's a yeah. wedding day you know um, and and Jay, Jay knew how to get around that. He knew how to get those cheesy shots without making it obvious. He was getting yeah, those cheesy shots. For sure. <laughs> it's like it's it's um 
Yeah, the, you are com Yeah, Jay was definitely accommodating to those 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 factors and those requirements, which I think a lot of men will probably relate to, and a lot of people will relate to as well. You know, in that sense, is the pre-shoot towards the end of the wedding, um, yeah. which was really cool as well. Again, one 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 highlight we always talk about is just remember Jay randomly saying to me like we were doing a few shoots and and, and a few of the actual uh, bits um, where we had time in between the yeah. wedding. And um, I remember just coming over to me and saying, like, um, go stand in front of that shed. I was thinking to myself, like, why is he asking me to stand in front of a shed? And honestly, in my head, I'm thinking, okay, there's something up with this guy. Like, why is he asking me? And that was one of the best shots of our wedding is, is, is the lighting that was shooting through the trees yeah, into like sure. where we were stood in front Jay, of him. Jay just knows what he's doing. Mm, and that's all you sure. really want. For sure, for sure. And the team were friendly. You can't ask for more than the team to be friendly. Um, and uh, another thing which is a major major factor in this in this industry i think anyway is 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 being bilingual you know being yeah. able to speak more than one language in that sense i know obviously f with with our family you spoke one or two languages or three languages if you had uh, yeah. if you had it up but i'm sure i'm sure he's got another you know hidden <laughs> hidden talent under his sleeve to speak another language as well but those things really definitely come into play yeah. as well you know making the family a bit more comfortable uh, you know you might have elders in your family that don't you know don't speak english for example and and that's when all of that kicks in and yeah. all of a sudden it's not just you know the youngsters or you know the, the immediate family that are comfortable but everyone else is yeah. also very comfortable yeah. around them as well you know for sure um and i felt like for our wedding do you not think it was they were the coordinators yeah almost right oh, yeah. so sometimes you're thinking oh but what do we do next but it's like oh no we know what to do next because jay's already sort of indicated yeah. oh by yeah. the way you it's time to do this in a little bit or it's time to do this bit because that's the next shoot so it was almost like it was nice and easy to follow in that sense, yeah. you know? Yeah. Whereas, whereas sometimes it's like, I remember sitting there thinking, okay, this is finished. What but next? Hopefully, I'll, hopefully I shouldn't know what's next or, you know, hopefully someone tells me what's next sort of thing. But I know for a fact I've got direct eye contact from one of the, like, you know, one of the, the guys taking the videos or one of the guys taking the picture. So I know straight away, it, you know, if I did need something, to, to a point, and I'm, you know, I, I, this is just being honest, to a point, sometimes it's a glass of water. They came <laughs> running over with a glass of water. And those small things you can't forget. And, if, yeah. and then, you know, people that do forget those small things, it's like, you don't, you don't. Especially on the day when you're, you know, you're on stage, nervous, and there's, you know, hundreds of people watching you, you know. So th those comfort levels definitely kick in. When, when, when you go with someone, you feel as though it's sort of, you know. In, as friendly it, as Jay is. Yeah, for sure. After the wedding. Everything's over, you know, you've, you've had your one or two weeks to settle in, everything. And then all of a sudden, it's just a bit of a downer in the sense that there's nothing going on, you know? There's nothing <laughs> wedding related, there's nothing Wedding like, blues. Wedding blues, definitely wedding blues. Uh, but then that's when you get the call from Jay, you know? Yeah. Saying there's a little trailer that he's got that's sort of, you know, um, uh, done for you. Um, there's a day where you come in, have some popcorn, sit down, you know, the watch. The movie day, it was so fun. The movie day. Um, then after the movie day. Um, the premiere. We had the premiere, yeah, but even even just the movie day itself, it was just so chilled and relaxed. It was just so nice that you go through yeah. each bit to be you able to You kind of relive of... everything, because when you're the bride and groom, you don't really remember much of the day. It's a bit of a blur. But then you go to the movie day, and then Jay does this really cool thing where he uh, releases the highlights on YouTube, but he does a premiere, so he sends everyone a link, and... Um, we actually did something quite cool. So our entire family got together. And do you remember there was like 20 of us? Yeah. All sat in front of the TV with a countdown going on. And my little cousins were there screaming like, five, four, yeah. three. And then we all watched the highlights together as a family. And it was really cool. Yeah. And I obviously we sent the link out to like all of our family and friends. Um, so everyone was watching them. I asked everyone to take a little, yeah. you know, short clip of everyone what watching they thought it at the same it. time. Yeah. And it's nice to get feedback like that, you know, even yeah. just for us more than anyone else. You know, it's nice to get feedback that people enjoy the wedding or then enjoy the end product of of, of the trailer or you know the the, the actual video. In but that it, sense it as well. almost felt like the wedding wasn't over because everyone was watching the premiere at the same time. Mm. So it it felt like. The wedding's still going on. Yeah, it was nice. It was nice, and it was a, it was a really nice and and touch to the, the the whole process as well. To be fair, sure. and it felt like you know it's not here you go here's your you know here's your here's your product and you know see you later sort of thing. There's there's you know a care yeah. care you know aspect to it after it as yeah. well, which is close to nothing. But yeah, that's that's pretty much everything I have to say about Jay. We're glad we went with him. Thank you, Jay. Eighteen-year-old me is proud. <laughs> Thank you, Jay.